As many of you will know, every single year since Freshly Grounded's inception, we have dedicated a month of Ramadan to raising money and awareness to this spot project. In fact, let me just pause there. For any of you who are new and don't know this story, let me explain in 40 seconds. In 2016, I had the bright idea to start a podcast. I called it The Next Phase and quickly I realised that in order to make this work, I'm going to need a co-host. Simultaneously, I was invited by Abu Bakr Islam to Gambia to see the project that he was working on. He wanted to provide a school, mosque and a housing for orphans. Off I went to Gambia and ended up meeting Big Man Sam, who, let's just say we got on like a house on fire. And you guessed it, ended up being my co-host. Thus, Freshly Grounded was born. Since then, with our hearts being connected to the project and considering it was the place that FG was rooted, we raised money for the project every round on. To date, this this audience, you guys, have donated over £50,000 and we try and go back as often as possible to show you guys where the money has gone. Phew. Now, this year, the Spot Project is raising money for something big. There's a village called Chamia in which we're looking to build a multi-purpose centre. Now, I could tell you all the varying things that this centre will provide by the will of Allah, but here's one that speaks volumes. The women in this village have nowhere to give birth safely and so are often having to ride a donkey cart nine months pregnant to the nearest ferry where they can then cross the river, which takes hours, to the nearest hospital to give birth. One woman got on the donkey cart but didn't make it there in time for the ferry and so they had to give her a boat and she ended up having to deliver the baby on the boat. Subhanallah. As of our last update, despite the child being safe, the mother is still dealing with post-birth complications. We live in a society where that kind of stuff is just unheard of. You know, even if a person was to give birth at home, you'd call the ambulance, the ambulance would be ready and they're there to support you with a home birth, let alone giving birth in one of our NHS hospitals. So when we first started raising money back in 2016, five years ago, uh, you guys, I, I wanted to raise £2,000 and you guys raised over £8,000 in the first year. And since then, you've gone from pillar to post. And last year in 2020, you guys raised £23,000 for Freshly Grounded for the Spot Project. So this year, I'm going to go on a absolute confidence boost. <laughs> And I just messaged the brother who's dealing with our page in the spot project and I asked him to raise our target to a target that we've never raised before, £30,000. We're going big. <laughs> £30,000, that's £1,000 a day. We've never asked to raise this much money, but I believe we can do it, inshallah. Last year we did 23, so I'm confident. So head over to spotproject.org forward slash freshly grounded to support this project. Before I go, the multi-purpose center does cover a, a, a whole load of other stuff. A, a place for the elderly to go and enjoy themselves. A place for the youth to go to safely enjoy themselves and so on and so forth. I just mentioned the uh, health uh, and women's birthing center because that's the one that just spoke so much volumes to me so please do go support at spotproject.org and inshallah we make that target assalamu alaikum i believe in you i believe in us assalamu alaikum